start the recording. Yeah, I'm maxed. I need to turn uh, turn down the game. I'm at 100%. Um, and if I turn the game down too much, we'll find out and uh, I'll fix it. Um, hi, Bling. So, hi everybody on the YouTube channel. This is... Um, this is something that people have been asking for for a little while. I've been playing a Fallout 4 file that people... Um, I've kind of been narrating to people my choices, my explorations and stuff. I'm about... Probably 100 hours in, gameplay-wise. Haven't done much of the main story. Mostly been wandering around and exploring settlements and stuff. I've gotten up to the point where you meet the railroad. Um, I just got a mission from Deacon. Uh, and we're probably not going to do that right away. Um, I'm going to do a bunch of other stuff uh, and have some fun. Um, this is mostly a test stream to uh, make sure the Roxia was working fine and, you know, get all this going. Um, I... I'm going to move my chat so it doesn't cover the follow part. Um, for those who are new in the Twitch audience, I'm going to ask that you not spoil anything ahead of where I am. Um, it's just a lot more fun for me to uh, figure things out as I go. Um, I have... I'm probably going to start out with... Um, the, uh, the last of Nick's core game case files before I continue onward. The last few things that I did, um, I maxed out Strong's affinity so that I can never deal with him again. Uh, here you are, you little piece of shit. Mm. Um, yeah, it's... Fuck you, asshole. Um, I have... Uh, I maxed out and romanced Curie off-screen. I apologize for that, but she was too adorable and I couldn't help myself. I uh, could not save that for a stream since I didn't know I'd be streaming. Um, I just completed Nick's uh, affinity quest, got his perk. I had started with Codsworth. I'm probably going to go back to Nick for the stream and work on the last of the case files from the core game before I do anything else. Um, but the companions I've found so far are Preston, Hancock, Codsworth, obviously, McCready, who it is really cool to see him again. Um, Kate should be standing right here. I don't know where she went. There's Nick. There's a Brahmin centipede, apparently. Uh, there's Kate. Uh, there's Strong. There's Dog Meat. There's Ada from Automatron, which I finished. Here's my robot wife. I think that's all the companions I have. Uh, yeah, no, Curie is going to be my main companion once I finished everybody's affinity. Um. I suppose I should show you guys my uh, skill tree, shouldn't I? And then I'll show you guys my uh, armaments. I am level 59. There's infinite levels, so I didn't go for a particular build. I just prioritize certain things. I have 7 strength, 5 perception, 10 endurance, charisma and intelligence, 4 agility, and 6 luck. I have not messed with Codsworth because it gets rid of his hat. I have three levels of Cap Collector. I have three levels of Rifleman. I don't have five levels of Rifleman because it took me 120 hours of this game to figure out that shotguns fell under the rifle uh, category. I have four levels of Armorer, one of Life Giver, um, four of Gun Nut. How do you train Luck? You can, um, you can put a point into each of these special stats um, with, a, with a stat point. Think Fallout 3's um, intense training, but it's unlimited. You can max out every stat. Uh, I have one Medic, four Gun Nut, four Locksmith, three Hacker, because I don't need the fourth point, uh, one Attack Dog, 
one Aqua Boy, three Scrapper, one Idiot Savant, which is the worst mistake I've ever made in my entire life, uh, one Better Criticals, one Science, two Local Leader, four Strong Back. I'm probably going to get the fifth level of Strong Back next. One Inspirational, and three Solar Powered. Now, I'm, um... <coughs> no, I don't think you can... I don't think a bobblehead gets you uh, the 11th point, does it? If so, I screwed myself hard. But, you know, whatever. What was I about to say? Um, I have... All of the bobbleheads, except Barter, Small Guns, and Strength. Uh, it is physically impossible for me to get the Strength bobblehead at the point in the story I am, um, I believe. You can... Yeah, I don't use chems. Alright, so my gear. Uh, my loadout. I have an Assassin's Advanced 10mm pistol. Um... I have a Lucky Quad Barrel Missile Launcher, I have a Muzzled 50 Cal Sniper Rifle, I have a Plasma Infused Handmade Rifle that I have no ammo for and I just found on a Legendary after installing the DLC. Um, I have a Suppressed Powerful Assault Rifle, which I have 8 billion... Hey! Minda, thank you for the sub! Thank you! And, hey, you're here. How's it going, dude? I will make sure not to spoil any hamstick. Um, I have a uh, tactical boosted agitated plasma pistol. And I have a... I have, this, is, this is my favorite weapon. I should probably give it a name. Vast Enhanced ad, uh, Advanced Combat Shotgun. That's a mouthful. My apparel. I have uh, deep-pocketed polymer combat armor, left arm... Destroyer's right leg, uh, insulated vault 111 jumpsuit, powered stuttered, studded leather right arm, sprinters, polymer combat armor left leg, steadfast brotherhood of steel, combat armor chest piece, and my wedding ring. Yeah, I, um, I was afraid of hitting targets that I didn't want to hit, so I left the Tesla gun at home. Oh, the Tesla gun sounds incredibly cool, but I venture with a companion, and I'm playing a good character, so. Sorry. Oh, before we go anywhere else, I want to show off this awesome shirt that I got. Oh, it's so goddamn cool, I love it. Anyway. Um, I am laden down with healing, so you won't see me pick up a ton of that. And look at all this amernation. <laughs> Particularly like my 130 missiles. Oh, yeah. But I, ha I have been playing quite a bit. Oh, I should probably show off... Um, uh, I have... 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 28 settlements, then subtract Mechanist Slayer and Boston International Airport. Right. Um, I think I will grab Nick. Where did you go, buddy? Um, the white was a little eye-searing for me. Um, I didn't grab purple for any particular reason except I found it soothing. Um, my Pip-Boy was also purple, but I was trying out blue for a little while. Where the hell are you, Nick? Nicholas Valentine, get your ass over here. Nope, that's Preston Garvey. I don't care about you.
You're my robot wife. I care about you. No, seriously, where did he go? Oh! There you are. Oh, right, he likes that, um... He likes that terminal. Hey, Nick! I love this guy's design. Look at him! Look at him! God, he looks so cool. I mean, there's nothing wrong with Preston Garvey. It's just that he's... He's less interesting than most of the other companions. He's more interesting as a quest giver than a companion. The best part of all that is that Nick and Codsworth share a voice actor. There's an echo in the game sound. It's probably, um... It's probably, uh, picking up the television on my microphone. Hang on. Okay, testing. Testing, 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 testing. Yeah, my name's Will in the game. <laughs> you may need a reboot? <laughs> oh my god, you're adorable. Uh, Codsworth, give me those... No, you hold on to him. You're the next one I'm going to level the affinity of. So, I haven't done... A ton of decorating. I'm waiting to see if uh, the echo disappeared when I changed how the uh, microphone picked stuff up. So, uh, let me know if it's still echoing. I haven't done a ton of decoration. Um, what I have... Assembled a garage, which I recently expanded. Please ignore that. I don't use... The audio in the game is very bad. Hmm. As in you can't hear it? Um, a uh, Roxio... Whoops, hold on, it fell off the desk. Using a Roxio and open broadcaster software. What the hell are you doing, Nick? So what, is it scratchy, or...? But yeah, I haven't done a lot of um, actual decorating. Um, this is the house that I built when I first got here, and I haven't really made prettier. Uh, it's mostly utilitarian. Place for me to dump uh, armor for strong and dog meat, armor for... Um, other companions that I haven't really dressed up yet, because I've pretty much just used Kiri. Uh, weapons to potentially hand off to companions and settlers. Uh, weapon collection. Random trophy items. Uh, random stuff for when I start to um, actually dress up my settlers. A random junk for when I start decorating a place. Uh, a couple racks for my magazines, a bobblehead stand, uh, just some place to store random misc notes. It's like I'm getting the audio from a TV using a bad microphone. Hang on. Let me turn this up a bit. 
Yeah, the Roxio I have is a couple years old. Um, I really should get a better capture card. Uh, I also have this, which I started, and like eventually I'm going to bury these in, you know, a ceremonial graveyard. But then it, I I can't stop without it being creepy. Well, uh, one of the most disappointing parts of the game, says Rabs, is uh, that when combat encounters from raiders invading settlements are resolved and you weren't there for it, things tend to get randomly broken because the game doesn't take into account at all turret placement or walls. Uh, especially because Bethesda sold the settlement system really hard. Um, I'm not really going to blame them for not simulating the, uh, the encounters all that hard when you're not present for them, considering how much else the game has to do at any one time. Um, it, could they have done it better? Yes. Hey, you get back in that pillory. Little asshole. Where are you going? Get, get back in there. Now, yeah, whatever. But yeah, I haven't really done anything to decorate this place. Um, right. So, oh, there's a kickball I let roll away. Why was she in a pillory? Because she is a rancid, whining bitch. Hey, Week, how you doing? Okay, quests. Where? Right, the disappearing act. Earl Sterling. There is still an echo. Is it bad? Can you still hear me like this? I'm trying to turn the mic. So that it doesn't. Um, so it doesn't pick it up. Alright. Earl Sterling case notes. Case. Earl Sterling's disappearance. Client. Vadim Bobrov. Oh, from Bob Rob's Best Moonshine. Another disappearing act to unravel. Earl Sterling. 25-year-old bartender at the Dugout Inn. One of the owners, Vadim Bobrov, noticed that Earl hadn't been into work for a few days. Security was called in. No investigation, of course. The Institute took him is the unofficial word around town. Like always. Vadim came into my office, half drunk, with a sob story about he and Earl went way back and that he just can't believe that Earl would get snatched up by the boogeyman. My gut says he's right. Earl didn't have any enemies, at least none with motive enough to kill the guy. Not living with anyone either, so I'll have to see if Vadim or someone else at the dugout has his keys. I'd rather not have to explain to security why I was picking the lock on Earl's door if I slip up and get caught in the act. Okay, well, let us be on our way to do the last of the case files from Nick. Diamond City Market. It only comes up when people are talking. Well, hopefully that's minimized. That's weird, though. I don't have any way to put on a pair of headphones into the... Uh, Uh, into the TV. Can you guys hear me okay now? I, I turned the microphone and I'm not sure if it's in a good position. Even if you are pounding around with Nick Valentine. Yeah, you, you keep telling yourself that. 
Okay, good. Um, what are the quest objectives? Search Earl Ster Sterling's house for clues. Obtain the key to Earl Sterling's house. Uh, yeah, let's let's get the key. I want to be polite about this. There's still echo on the audio dialogue, but not on the rest of it. Not when I shoot things or any of that. That's weird. Hmm. points of danger tops now, you want to talk something really big i forgot you was here yet what is it you know what never mind i'll handle it myself oh oh okay that was just random dialogue Jesus Bar, I killed a man for it. <laughs> no, 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 I killed it, I killed it. <laughs> he is dead, though. <laughs> now, let me know when you're ready to watch. Why do you have a Russian accent 200 years after Russia died? Earl Sterling used to work here, right? Poor Earl, gone just like that. Such a good bar friend. Good friend. Oh, terrible with women, mind you. Bull in China shop. You with Valentine's, Valentine's Detective Agency? I forgot to drop off girl's key when I hired the people. Here, I hope you find out what happened. Security does nothing but yell at me for asking about it. I got a bar to Let me know if you want something. Hmm. Okay, so he's being helpful. So, this your bar? So, this your bar? Damn straight it is. My brother Yefim and I make the best moonshine in the entire comic. We call it Bobrov's Best. Had to start renting out rooms just so customers get a place to safely pass out after drink. <laughs> Not today. Not today. That's too bad. Yeah, I don't drink anyway. The worst offender is how how does Kate have that heavy accent? Oh, I got a thing. Yeah, we're here in the... Is it a really bad echo? The audio is coming in ahead of the visual. Hmm. That's odd. Well, it is a test stream. It's the day to figure this stuff out. Game audio does need to go up a little. How do I fix the echo, though? Hmm. That's the question. Roxy ha Roxio has a slight delay. Yeah, no, I, like, I don't know how I could, um... I don't know how I could... I could just silence the uh, the TV. That would kill the echo, but it would mean I couldn't hear the game. If the echo is bad enough, I'll do that. Yeah, I'll I'll. Uh, Ever seen a Meyer alert? Turn that down for now. Cross with the tank. Okay, so
let's get on with the uh, with the case. Barrier between TV and mic. Put a book on it. I mean, my my TV is over here. Uh, like my TV is here. My microphone is. My TV is over here. My microphone is uh, down here. You have your headphones go into the TV you use. Your second TV's audio for Twitch alerts. But well, give me a sec. I'm going to see if I have a microphone port. Need new clothes? Should stop by Fallon's basement. Open during the day. I do not have a headphone port on my television, so I'm just gonna have to suck it up for a while. Yeah. Right, uh... Yeah, because I silenced my television. So now you guys can hear the game just fine, but I can't. Alright, let's see the hell is going on in this house. <laughs> it's a Christmas miracle. <clears throat> Excuse me. Search Earl Sterling's house for clues. Why don't you check out the living room? Must be some hint. Where some hint where that boy ran off to. You know, for all the talk, I put the chances of this being an institute snatch job somewhere between zero and none. Zero and none. Just think, think about, about it. it. Earl Local Sterling, assistant bartender. Why not have the bartender himself? Bartender. Why not? I mean, because you got to slowly infiltrate the place, Nick. Lord knows, Vadim samples his own wares enough that some weird behavior. I mean, he's got a point about Vadim. That's an odd one. Oh, yeah, I won't... Earl had lousy people skills, might score the Institute some points in the last person you'd ever suspect category. Jesus. <laughs> Snatch someone with charm. Barely get you a drink by closing on a busy night. But where's that leave us? No known enemies. Wasn't well, much for the great outdoors, so likely not raiders or mutants. Much for the great outdoors, so likely not raiders or mutants. Now, Earl screams accident. accident. What Earl? What was Earl into that might have gotten in this kind of trouble? God, I love just listening to Nick Valentine talk. Um, a few hours at least. My best solid snake. Uh. Well, give me a sec. I'm gonna finish looting this poor man's house. You seeing what I'm seeing, seeing, what I'm over, seeing here? over? Aha! Surgery receipt. He got a new face. He's living a new life. Maybe he took Vadim's place. I'll be here as long as you're happy. Hey, Teddy. Also, you guys have asked for a best solid snake voice. You guys have asked for my best solid snake voice. I've never actually played a Metal Gear Solid. So I'm horribly butchering this. And I've never actually listened to this voice on a recording. So when I listen to this video later for editing, it'll be horrible. <coughs> oh, excuse me. It'll be horrible. <laughs> yeah, so that was terrible. <laughs> Wait, that was good? That 
can't be good. The end of my headphone cord, okay? Yeah, the Metal Gear Solid games are on the stream list. All right, was there another page to this? There was not. All right. The Mega Surgery Center. All right, so uh, my bet is he is now Vadim, and Vadim is dead. All right, Nick, let's go. I wish I could hear the luxurious sound of your voice. But, sacrifices. At least you guys get to get to listen to him. He's such a good performance. Oh my god. Okay. Um, I'm going to pause real quick. Be right back. Okay, I'm back. I think I know what Sean has planned, but uh, we shall see. Hey, the Bobrov brothers are looking for me. All right, well, let's take a quick detour and talk to uh, the other Bobrov and see if um, Vadim's been acting strangely. Diamond City security being unhelpful. Oh, Just here we go. Name. Quiet, if you. All right, you. Tell me. Diamond City already. Oh, this is completely, uh, uh yes. this is completely you want to cut your own ears separate. So, what's the issue? Have you not listened? This DJ He is kind of, terrible. he is kind of terrible. I have, I have listened to him. I don't listen to the radio much in these games. Um, because I don't enjoy the genre of music that they play. We need a new DJ for the radio. I don't think many would notice if he, you know. Are you asking me to? Are you serious? Did we not just agree? This oh my God! Serious problem. Calls for serious. <laughs> he liked that I backsassed him. First, you get him to follow you out of town. If oh, this is a joke. That's you enough. One second. Him isn't buddy. serious. He doesn't really want to kill Travis. Okay, what's really going on here? Sorry, we were just joking around a bit. <laughs> it's true. Only Don't tell you if what was Travis real. Is a good friend. Yefim and I worry about it. Well, Travis, he, he means well, but he does not have the confidence he needs for that job. Or anything else, really. And so he's always awkward. He does not believe in himself, you see? He expects he will fail at everything, and so he does. So, are you actually trying to do something about it? I tell you, teams, that I have planned. Alright, what believe. idiot plan do you have, Vadim? You and I work on plan. Go on, spoil sport. Go back to working. Come, you. Meet me in back room. We discuss plan. Okay, the spoils are working. Good. Alright, we're gonna, we're gonna leave that off the fact that Vadim gave me a quest means that the real one is still alive almost certainly well there is another Bobrov brother that I could uh let's just hmm. say they can afford a lot of those need a room did you know Earl Sterling one of my brother's old friends oh boy the way those two would go on about girls you'd think Vadim is loud now Earl was a horrible womanizer, and I warned him more than once to leave the staff and customers alone. But my brother always stood up for him. Honestly, kind of glad he's gone. Wouldn't shut up about the new face he was going to get at the mega surgery center. Vain till the end. Anyway, did you want a room? Maybe he's this guy. What's the story with this place? Not much to say. We sell food huh. and rooms, mainly for traders that come to the area. 
My e fiu. Alright, Scarlet. Is that you? Um, whatever it is, keep it to yourself. Miss? Hi there. You can order drinks and food here or at the bar. Did you work with Earl Sterling at all? Oh, yeah, Earl. Yeah. I mean, I know I shouldn't speak ill of the missing, but that guy needed to get out. You'd think a bartender would be smooth, you know? Charming? Not Earl. He tried so hard, too. Way too hard. The real sad thing? He thought it was his looks. He kept talking about getting a new face over at the mega surgery. Wouldn't have helped. Uh, anyway. I at the very I least, uh, I think I think Earl is hiding in somebody else's identity. The Bobrov brothers picked this place up a few years ago. Uh, the Dean Bobrov is the loud one. Yefim Bobrov is the quiet one. And I'm the one that has to listen to the Margie. All day. Just looking. Alright, hon. Hmm. Don't know you scared. I'll talk to Vadim about Earl later. Hmm. I can see a visitor pulling into my driveway. I think you guys are gonna to get to see Sean in a minute. I talk about him often enough. Alright. Okay. Hello, iBot. I have an instilled hatred of you from Fallout 3. Hmm. Dr. Sun. Hey, Doc. This better be an emergency. Do you know anything about this receipt? Let me see. Hmm. This is Dr. Crocker's deplorable handwriting on. Looks like Earl Sterling was one of his patients. The procedure noted here is mundane. Low risk Earl cosmetic. vanished before he paid. Dr. Okay. Never performed it, however. That changes Earl things. Vanished before he paid. Now, let's get back to talking about your medical needs. I hear Sean, so I'm gonna save real quick just in case. Boom. Hey, what's up, dude? All right. First of all, special delivery. Thank Second you. Second of all, more special delivery. Ooh. Plug a headphone jack into that. Okay. And eventually find a USB slot somewhere around here to go into the PS4. Problem solved. Dude, really? That yeah. works? Yeah. Oh, sick. Ignore the uh, headphone jack on the end of the PS4. Or er, thing, that doesn't matter. Okay, hang on. I can do it into the controller port, right? Yep. That's exactly where it goes. Okay, and... Sorry, guys. Then you'll want your Twitch alerts to come out of some audio source that you'll be able to hear. Um, Those are not noise-canceling headphones. You'll hear it. <laughs> Fair enough. Okay. Alright, I don't hear it. So uh, volume. It's, it's on the PS4 and it's probably... Oh, well, let's see. Yeah, that plugged in all the way. That's all the way up. These are all the way up. Can you see the controller? Easy fix. Uh, overwrite that save data, please. Just in case. Yeah. Welcome to the co-op stream. Yeah, this is Stax. Um, uh, real life friend. Sound devices. All audio. I'll put the headphones all audio. You got it now? I do. Holy shit. It's a little quiet, but... Oh, uh, well... We can fix that too. Awesome. It's probably not quiet anymore. <laughs> All right, that concludes the co-op stream. Thank you for thank you for that, man. No problem. I got the box. How soon do you want this back? Um, sometime between now and whatever year it actually is in Fallout Four. <laughs> thank you. Stax is the man. Now I can actually hear the game. Oh, I can hear it.
Oh, shit. Now there's no audio? Well, crap. Okay, hang on. Okay, guys, sorry about that. Um, what's going to happen is I'm going to put it back the way it was so that uh, you guys can hear it. Um, and then uh, Sean's going to get here and he's going to help me uh, fix it so we can both hear it. All right, the key to the surgery cellar. Can you guys hear it now? Ah, oh. okay. My PC looks really close to me. Um, I mean, it's at arm's length. You guys cannot hear it now. Where does blood come from? It goes right into the base. Gee, well, that sounds like something bad happened. Or, well, I guess I am at a doctor's place. What is wrong with his eyes? He's a robot. He's a robot. Where'd you go, Nick? Nicholas Valentine, where are you? Here, get a good look at him. He is a synthetic human being. See how his skin's uh, not all there? Okay, so you guys can't hear the game audio at all. Hey, you're the one who stopped to talk to me, kid. Hmm. That's weird. What is this? Oh, it's another copy of the Synthetic Truth. Alright, while I wait for Sean to show up, I'm gonna do a little shopping. Not that I really need to do anything for money, but I'm going to buy a few things that'll help me with experience points. So, food. I'm sorry, I'm going to buy some things from you. You don't want to sell? What? What? Okay. Oh, it thought she, the game thought she was still uh, the game thought she was still um, not at her shop. All right, meat, 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 meat. Not a lot. Uh, sell the mine. Mm, sell all but one bobby pin. Sell some folders. Sell, 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 sell. Am I not able to invest? I'm actually going to reset and invest. Okay. Yeah, I'm. I'm a big, big fan of the robots. No, I'm actually going to. Turn the duct tape into adhesive. Any more money. Red Scorpion Stinger. Silver, silver, silver. Uh, weapons. Plasma mine. I mean, that's the junk that's too annoying to uh, catch and turn into stuff. Um... Okay, let's see. Are you able to hear it now? 
Is that a pip boy? Give my left arm for one of those. Uh, you get a perk. If you don't live here, you uh, I have so much nuclear material. You guys have no idea. Uh, I got a perk that lets me invest 500 caps into a store once to permanently raise uh, the amount of caps they have on hand by 500. It's an initial investment that turns out to be pretty good long term because you clear them out of all their caps. Okay, so you guys can hear it now. I'm going to test a thing. See if it undoes this. So, now you guys can hear it. Um, hmm. I wonder if he's selling another set of power armor. You know, a shotgun's great insurance against raiders. Sure, let's take a look. Everything hand tool. Let's see what you got, buddy. Some fusion cells for the wife. Uh, some leaded stuff. Oh, he does sell power armor frames every so often. Cool. Alright, we're going to put the quest on pause while Sean comes back. I should probably go and lock the door for him. Hang on. Right. Well, this is the point of a uh, this is the point of a test stream, after all. All right. Let's see what's down here. I've never met this Doctor Crocker. You've really been a handful, you know. I guess I have now. But I think we're just about done. Our little mistake is finally going to be corrected. Oh, naughty, naughty. You're not supposed to be down here, but that's okay. I can fix that. I can fix anything. Wow, okay. Why are you running a torture dungeon? You weirdo. What did you do to Earl Sterling, Doctor? What did I do? I, I didn't do anything. It was, uh, it was Earl. It was Earl who didn't want to be happy? It was Earl who happy. Good patients get a nice new face. Bad patients bleed all over the floor because they want to screw up their surgeon's life. So you were performing surgery? I uh, might have had just a bit of jet before. Oh my operating. god. Well, so this wasn't the convoluted case I thought it might have been, but. I'm a problem solver, you see. I knew if Earl disappeared. Everyone would just think the Institute took him. Why would people think the Institute took Earl Sterling? That's what they do. That's what they've always done. As long as there's no body... Alright, well, I hear Sean, so hang on, guys. Here I come to try and save the day again. Fair enough. Yeah. Yeah, that renders my whole gift useless. I um, appreciate it, though. Rip. Rip in pepperoni. Right, you take that back. I'll take this back. And uh, here, I'll do it for you, so you don't uh, so have I don't a heart attack. Your PS4. Dude, if you guys could see this right now, <laughs> no, I'll let them see it. Uh oh, here we go. Lord I'm Weaver keeping it off of reveal. the ground. I'm keeping it off of the carpet so it doesn't overheat. Yeah, no, I've just that's a unique. I don't have any other furniture, man. Here, take this. <laughs> if you guys could see, like, this this whole setup, this is like the MacGyver of streaming right now, I, I swear. Why, thank you. <laughs> and he's going to fix this problem using old tube socks and a copper wire. <laughs> All right. Okay, you guys can hear it again now, though. So, that'll have to be good enough for the moment. So that's what you were doing? Cutting Earl's body up? You can't just get rid of 200 pounds of cadaver without attracting attention. 
Fortunately, the butcher shop is close by. If their trash pile just happens to have an extra box of rotten meat, It does have a USB. We tried that. It didn't work. You really think you can get away with this? Get away with this? <laughs> Don't you know who I am? I'm Doc Crocker. Doc Crocker never does anything wrong. I think you're still and high, this buddy. Is all over, no one will have any reason to question that. <laughs> Violence. All right, I'm going to try to arrest him. I'm going to save scum to do it. Hey, I, I got the video and audio to work and stream to Twitch, so that's a triumph. You've killed a man, Doctor. You're going to pay for it. Put the gun down. Oh, I've got a call coming. Point that. There. Yeah, this stream is going to have to be heavily edited. Whoops. For a second there, I forgot he was just putting boxes in the trash. He thought you had a Sweeney Todd situation because I just bought meat from the butcher. Yeah, that would have been a kick in the dick. Where the hell did I put the... There it is. I'm blind. I did it, didn't I? I killed a man. Oh, oh God. <laughs> There's so much blood. So much blood all over me. I can fix anything. Did he just... Huh. What's going on here? Is, is that Dr. Crocker? Right, um, I'm just gonna take that. I think you owe me an explanation. What happened here? Did you know what Doc Crocker was doing down here? That's Earl Sterling's body, isn't it? Somewhere in the back of my mind, I knew he had gone through with the surgery. So, Earl didn't just vanish. The procedure went badly. And Dr. Crocker was just trying to cover it up. You didn't know. It's not your fault. Of course it's not my fault. That moron and his damn appearance over practice mentality. Now two lives have been lost. It's disgraceful. I'd better report all this to security. Get out of here. It's going to take a long time to clean this place of biohazards. Yeah, um, first I'm gonna... Take that coat and the extra key. Looks like it'll be a closed casket funeral. Oh, wow, rude. No, uh, that's all stealing. I think I will skip that. The Roxio OBS thing, you linked me. Um, the links in the post don't lead anywhere anymore. Um, the thing I'm using... Where the hell are you, Nick? Oh, there you are. Hey. Juan. Well, don't keep me in suspense. Your thoughts? Every scumbag in the Commonwealth is gonna know our name. Your thoughts? I've Nothing to say about what just happened? Alright. But they sure bring in the business. But yeah, that's, uh, I went for me, uh, but with more hair. Don't know how close I got. Actually, looking in the, uh, video preview, I did actually get pretty close. It's been a few years. What? Did I say? Oh, nothing. Got it. <sighs> All right, well, Nick, let's see. Let's see what other cases you may have. I suppose I could technically trigger Far Harbor right now. Hmm. I might save Far Harbor for after I figure out the audio issue. Maybe I'll borrow one of Sean's TVs so I can actually uh, hear the audio while I do that content. Because uh, that's set um, uh, less than 100 miles from where I'm sitting. Maybe around 100 miles from where I'm sitting. So it'd be really cool to actually get to experience that. All right, let's see if you got any more uh, missions. Was it just the Gilded Grasshopper and Earl Sterling? Or were there others? 
I'm glad you're here. We got a new case while you and Nick were out. Ready to put on the detective hat? Well, look who's back. How things turn out with Marty. Not great. Dead. Made it all the way through Faneuil Hall, too. Went out like a champ. Who's our client? A fisherman, whose family lives on the edge of the Commonwealth. Kenji Nakano. Maybe if you bothered writing things down, Nick. Huh. I'll remember that the next time you need me to console a hysterical client. Mr. Nakano didn't leave me. I think we just mixed up two dialogue trees. But if you want my guess, missing person case. Guy had a worried look a mile long. Anything you can tell me about Kenji Nakano? Just some impressions. He was obviously upset, but he was also in a hurry. Like, he couldn't stand just waiting around. I'm a friend of Nick's. He'll remember me. I need his help right away. And then he was gone. He was muttering something on the way out, but... No. I'm not sure it was important. Come on, Ellie. Don't hold out on me. What did he say? Well, I thought I heard him say something about a daughter and also a radio, but... I might have misheard him. Not sure how the two would be connected. Metro Boomin 25, thank you for the follow. I'll go check it out. Thanks. The Nakano residence is Yeah, this this is the Far Harbor Quest tag. House. He said that he and his wife will be waiting for you. It's a long walk. That's how the hog case is always stuck. God, I love watching his face move. Okay, um so, let's see if there are any case files. Was it just Earl Sterling and, uh... I already got this Robco fun. Excellent. I already have that. That's weird. Did it just respawn? Now I have two copies of that. Unless... Let me check my checklist. Robco fun. No, I got all the Robco fun already. That's weird. Yeah, I'm going to need audio for Far Harbor, um, so I'm not going to uh, follow that quest hook right now. I am going to wait on that and do other stuff for tonight's stream. Uh, at worst, I'll see if I can borrow one of Sean's TVs that we know has the right setup for me to plug a pair of headphones into. Um, that way you guys aren't listening to a horrible... Oh, hey, there we go. The Mysterious Stranger. Sightings of a man dubbed the Mysterious Stranger have been popping up sporadically across the old U.S. for years now. Best case, the man's an amoral lunatic. Worst case, a prolific serial killer. All anyone knows is his M.O. Appearing suddenly, killing without remorse, disappearing without a word. The Stranger has no known accomplices, no clear method for selecting his targets, no calling cards left behind. Sightings range from the NCR all the way to the East Coast, stretching back decades. Now, he's come to the Commonwealth. Last thing this place needs is another psychopath running amok. Time to start putting together the pieces to put this one away. Description. Human male. Outfits vary, but most recent sightings describe a large overcoat and fedora. Guy has taste, I'll give him that much. Starfire Z669, thank you for the follow. Welcome aboard. One man, multiple men, a ghoul with minimal scarring, might explain the long passages of time between sightings, appears and disappears suddenly, suggesting preternatural infiltration abilities, access to advanced cloaking tech. All but the earliest description suggest the stranger uses only conventional arms, making infiltration training more likely. Perps like this make me wish the Institute had sprung for thermal detection before giving me the boot. Sighting locations. Commonwealth. Confirmed. Capital Wasteland. Confirmed. NCR. Old rumors. Shady Sands. Really old rumors. Okay, so that's not actually a case file, but it is pretty cute. Huh. Everything in here just respawned, didn't it? Alright, got any case files up here? Sir, you two find out where Earl Nick Brew is gay. Thank you for the follow. Uh, let me actually talk to her. Thing. You ever find out where Earl Sterling ran off to? Derptron, thank you for the follow. Did I get hosted and I never got the notice? Earl's not doing a lot of running anymore. Being 
Chopped to bits by Doc Crocker will do that. Crocker killed Earl? Upon as long as he was, I figured maybe Raiders or the Indians Yeah, the Mysterious Stranger, Crocker. um, uh, I took it in three. In a cell, I hope. Crocker killed himself. He couldn't take the guilt. Goodness. I'm sorry you two had to go through that. Here, take this. Sounds like you earned it. I'll send word along. Let everyone down at the dugout in know what happened. Shame it couldn't be better news. Huh, you're not making Miko take care of that? Weird. Completed the disappearing act. Be careful when you head over to the Nakano residence. That whole area is pretty isolated. All right. So, are there any other files? I wonder what the story is between. It was just Marty and Earl. Well, that's kind of disappointing. Oh well. Mr. Nakano seemed like a good sort. Well, let's get. Uh, let's scrap some of this leaded armor, and then let's get back to wandering. I think I've got the audio at a good place where I can hear it, but you guys can't hear an echo. Playing with luck reminds me of a Yu-Gi-Oh player comboing off against a complete newbie to the game with a starter deck. That's actually a pretty good analogy. I like that. Arturo's hat. Right, because that's... You're bothering. Well, fuck off then. Tojoik, thank you for the follow. Welcome aboard. Kawaii Fatty 22. I definitely got hosted by somebody, but it never gave me the notice. Thank you to whoever hosted me, who I missed. I apologize for not calling you out, but uh, quite a few new people showing their faces in the chat tonight. Stax has never played the real Yu-Gi-Oh card game, but he has played Yu-Gi-Oh Duelist of the Roses. Loves that game. Sean and I are, um, we're Magic the Gathering players. Spent too much time in that to really find Yu-Gi-Oh fulfilling. Sorry. Okay, I gotta test. Okay, yeah, it is picking up the audio. Good. Um, right. Get some of that well, lead. That he uh, he has seen the uh, um, that video where the uh, voice actors of Yugi and Kaiba played the game. That was that was pretty silly. I loved that. All right, let's. Oh, I can make iguana soup. God, taking taking idiot savant was the worst mistake I have made in my entire Fallout playthrough history. <laughs> Good God, that's a lot of mongrel dog meat. Okay. I'm probably going to need to pawn some uh, stuff off on on my next companion. Alright, roasted Meyer Lurk meat. I don't have any soft shell. Wolf ribs? What? I guess that's Far Harbor content. Alright, well, uh, I just leveled up. You're gonna you're gonna do um, you're gonna do the sound effect for everything, aren't you? What was I gonna get next? Jman ninety eight ninety eight. Thank you for the follow. Welcome aboard. 
Right, I was getting to the next strong back, so I can move more when I'm over encumbered, which is always. Alright, let's dump some stuff. I think I'm gonna drop this handmade rifle, because apparently you can't find that ammo outside Far Harbor. No, I do not want to take all. It's your duty. Oh, God. Drop the lab coat. Um, do I have any junk I want to store? No. All right. Well, let's uh, let's go grab a companion to le to uh, raise the affinity with on our way, and get back to questing, shall we? Any cool legendaries? Um, mostly just the stuff I'm carrying. Uh, here, I'll show off my uh, my arsenal again. <laughs> Fahaba. I've lived in Maine for twenty. Six out of the 29 years I've been alive, alive, uh, maybe 25 out of 29 years, and I say Far Harbor with R's. Okay, so what do you guys think? Codsworth, McCready, or Piper next? I'm not really in the mood for Kate or uh, Preston or Hancock right now. And while I wait for that answer, I'll show off my weapons. Okay, so I got this guy, which I've tricked out. The Assassin's Advanced, 10 mil. It's not just a Fallout meme. Um, it's a Mainer meme. Because that's... Uh, Mainer's not pronouncing their R's. Is a thing. Uh, I got this Assassin's Advanced 10 mil pistol. Uh, you know, I'll just equip each of them and... Yeah, I got the bullets to spare. Got my baby. Combat shoddy. Which is a VATS enhanced. Um, I got this muzzled 50 cal sniper. I hate scoped weapons. Uh, I got... This, I got the Lucky Quad Barrel Missile Launcher, which I found the way it is. I have changed almost nothing about this thing. Um, and I got this Plasma Pistol. Okay, so I got one vote for McCready. Going once. Up here, us Mainers like to go to Bar Harbor and have some wicked good lobster. And go down the way over there and pick up some sodas. Go figure, the one thing you pronounce an R in is the thing that doesn't have an R in it. Well, you guys are uh, putting in votes. I'm going to go say hi to my robot wife. How are you doing? I must confess. I am You're the only person to vote. I hope you've come so we can travel again together. <laughs> She's so cute. I love her. Let's Here's uh, what I outfitted her with. Uh, doop doop. I'm going to give her some fusion cells. Because nothing is too good for my beautiful robot wife. Fiberglass combat armor, right arm. Combat armor, right leg. I didn't really trick out her armor because I hadn't maxed out armorer. Uh, you're voting. Do I want to take McCready, Piper, or Codsworth with me uh, to wander around? Because I'm maxing affinity. No, Sean. Shut up. That doesn't even make sense except for the uh, terrible... Uh, Matthew Broderick Stepford, Stepford Wives remake, which was great until the stuff they added on with the robots. Uh, not with the robot, with the um, 
Actually, I can't remember if the original was robot replacements or um, brainwashing. It was one of the two. <laughs> Codsworth and Modem like crazy. <laughs> Dip the hash hash sheen is now following. Thank you for the follow, Dip. Uh, like she needed more charisma and intelligence. And the wedding ring, because she is my robot wife. Okay, so we got a vote for Codsworth, and we got a vote for McCready. My personal preference at the moment is Codsworth, to get him out of the way. But I get that he's not the most interesting of the companions. Why are you over here? You're assigned to defense. Right, that's why Kate's wandering around. Alright, we got another vote for Codsworth. Looks like it'll be Codsworth. Get the hell over here, you fat asshole. Hey, Puppo. I love, I love, love, love the way they animated dog meat in this game. It's so good. He's so cute. If you could have him and a companion without mods, I would be. I'm getting achievements before I play with mods. Eventually, there will be a playthrough where I play with a bunch of mods. Okay, we got uh, three votes for Codsworth. Bowler hat it is. Hey, Codsworth. Shall I accompany you, sir? Yes, of course. As you wish, sir. Don't let this one boss you around too much, Codsworth. There's nothing I'd like more, Mr. Valentine. Okay, let's check out the quest list. Confidence man, speak to Vadim. I'm going to do that one later. We could do trade craft... Uh, I'm not doing Nuke World. I'm not doing Vault 88 uh, until I figure out something with the TV. Hey, Sean, you're still in the chat, right? Um, I was going to ask, at some point, maybe I could borrow a TV that we know has a headphone port. Um, it's uh, like for a night when I want to stream some of the uh, some of the content. But uh, I know that's not really a permanent solution. I just wanted to... Um, Floated. Uh, I'm not sending Buddy to the Hotel Rexford. I'm keeping him forever. I'm not doing... Uh, maybe I could do the Brotherhood. Yeah, whatever. Alright. Jobber Brothers Disposal. Here we come. Uh, where the hell did I... Right here. Let's get our murder on, shall we? Yeah, like the... Uh, honestly, I like that they gave him... I have not done dance yet. Um, I got to the Brotherhood, realized what assholes they are in this game. Um, they're like some unholy hybrid of the worst parts of of uh, the old brotherhood coupled with lion's um, interventionism. Yeah, a lot, a lot of advance notice. Yeah, I got you, man. Um, all right. Assholes, mole rats. That's it. Fuck you. Oh, a glowing one. Why am I having so much trouble with goddamn mole rats? Yeah, I'm not hurting for nuclear material because of all this. Oh, hi. Blah, blah, blah. 
blood sample. More rat meat. More rat meat. Radiated blood. Okay. Uh, do I want to stick around and loot this place? I've cleared it before. The loot's probably respawned, actually. Let me see. Uh, bottle caps. Do the do. Um, I could probably find some kind of, uh, I could probably find some kind of adapter, but okay, wait, hang on. I tried all s I thought I tried all six. Oh, that was not what I meant to do. Oh, it's just my TV doesn't have a headphone port, so I can either... Um, I have heard the... I, I've heard the Bioshock Infinite rap, um, but don't spoil anything about Bioshock Infinite for me, because I haven't played that, and you're going you're gonna to get a blind stream of it. Um... Nox, uh, Nox. I'm in. Right, yeah, I've already done that. There's a safe right there that I can pick the lock for. EXP. Um. Nice. So it's not that anything's broken, it's that there's a functionality missing. Um, uh, my choice is, uh, have no... Who's my what's it? Have no audio, um, but let you guys listen to it. Have audio so I can hear it, let you guys hear it, and have a horrible echo because my mic's picking up my TV. Or have only me be able to hear the game, uh, the commands. I know how I know how to do it. I was confused because um, I misread one of the uh, inputs and hit the wrong thing. Right. We'll go back to nice Reese in a minute. For now, I'm gonna loot. All right, uh, tonight Reese. Eh, bottle kept mine, but I already, uh, I already fast traveled. Oh, it was it was a, a one that was set up. Yeah, this game doesn't really require precision sound cues, but I'd rather not listen to it at all than have the delay, I think. Also, hi, Giza. How you doing? Excuse me. Presumably outside the armor. Oh, your leg's still hurting? That sucks. Has, has the medicine not helped? That stinks. Alright, Reese, where are you? Over here, apparently. Hey, asshole. About time you showed your face. I take it that area's clear? Affirmative. Affirmative. Looks like I got my surprise for the well, day. Shut up, asshat. As long as the Brotherhood's around, those abominations don't stand a chance. If you're interested in heading out on another mission, you let me know. Anytime. What's the mission? Clearing trash. Mutants, ghouls. It's all the same to me. All waiting to be exterminated. All right, what do you got for me, dickweed? Here's the data on the location. Don't come back until the op's done. Ooh, is that... Alderseed Day Spa. That's a new area. Okay. <laughs> I 
I mean, I modeled him on me. Of course he looks like a nerd. He's also an asshole who spits on Elder Lion's memory. Fucking hate Maxon. Yeah, I... Legendary Brotherhood Aspirant. Really? It spawns random legendary friendlies? Huh. When it comes to keeping the also, I'm going to see what that explosion was about. Somebody's fighting over here. Wow. I almost want to just let this happen. Too late. Fine. I bought helmet. Okay. Fuck you. Do do. And what do the ghouls have? Ooh, yeah, shotgun here. I'll take the extra shells. Thank you. Leaded item. You're playing Skyrim, because you're, but you're going to have to redo some things because you glitched out a quest by doing it backwards. Leaded. Shadowed Eyebot Helmet. I mean, I'll take it. Just to add to my collection. Alright, where's this day spa? Aldersea Day Spa. That's way the hell up there. Okay. Yeah, the robot repair kit was a really obvious patch that they gated behind DLC. You could have added it into the main game via, via patches, people. But, uh, I don't know. Let's see if anybody here needs anything. 8, 11, 9, 10, 11. No, we're good. Where's the workshop? See if they've Crops dumped any good. interesting things inside. Uh, nothing new. Nope, there's a stew pot there that I will uh, break down in a little bit. Okay. Aldersea Day Spa. Yeah, uh, dogs can receive a stim pack with the same dose without any ill effects. That's, you know, kind of biologically inaccurate. Um, dosage requirements are a thing. Hmm, maybe on the way here I will explore this area. Over here. Yeah, let's take a detour. Why not? I actually keep marking out the Salem Museum of Witchcraft, meaning to go there, and I keep not going there. And I really should actually go there at some point. Oh, hey, there's a bridge. Let's see if it's covered in mines. I didn't actually need to swim across that. Oh, I'm not seeing any mines. Interesting. All right. Well, let's approach this properly. What do we have here? What is it? It is Makra fish packing. Okay. That's, that sure is a dead raider. Switch to it where I get audio if I go to Salem. Got it. Noted. 
yeah, I'm not going to do anything super important on this stream, I don't think, because I do want... I do want to um, get a fix, even if, that, even if I have to save up for like a month and get a, get a TV with a headphone slot. Let's see out front here before I go in. I love how I just don't give a shit about barbed wire. Oh, hey, a side area. It's not even an indoor. Alright, what we got? We got the dead raider. Marker facilities key. Uh, fine. I'll lose the lock picking. No, <coughs> I can't return it because I bought it like two years ago. It's been serving as my second monitor. Which is weird because I got my primary monitor used at a goodwill. Um, and it's got a better resolution than the TV. That you're seeing this on. But yeah, no, I got this like two years ago. It's far too late to return it. I don't have the receipt anymore. The TV works fine. There's nothing wrong with the TV. It's just lacking this one thing that I didn't foresee as a problem until two years in. Cannot sneak under that. Noted. Here's a question. Is it just Strong that likes when you kill things, or when you kill enemies? Um, or do they all get a small amount of passive affection boost from it? Alright, so there's nothing over here. Man, whatever hit this place before me was thorough. I didn't take any of the interesting shit, though. Ah, oh, excuse me. Alright, let's see what this is about. Macro fish packing. Is everything already dead in here? Did I miss the entire party? Now you guys will have to tell me. Uh, one of the reasons why I was hesitant to stream this game initially was because I thoroughly loot everywhere that I go in. And I thought that would be uninteresting to watch, but the people I expressed that to were all, no, we would absolutely watch you look through boxes and occasionally shoot something. I... I, uh, there's no accounting for taste. But... I'm happy to try. Boston Blue. Message sent, June 23rd, 2077. Good news. We were able to secure a contract with two local boats who agreed to supply us with half of their bluefish. Well, 100% would have been great. At least we're making a dent in our competitor's inventory. With the bluefish in full migration up north at this time, this will help keep our inventory steady. Jane. George, I'm leaving early. 
The fumes from the delivery trucks are giving me a migraine again. How many times do I need to tell maintenance to fix the ventilation fans in here? Could you be a deer and finish up the draft of the new Haddock contract I've been working on? You're the best. Thanks. Oh, thank you, Teddy. I won't read his compliments out loud because they are effusive and it, would, it feels a little narcissistic to put that on video, but thank you, Teddy. Everyone hears the sirens outside, right? Can someone please tell us what's going on? No one will let us out. They said to lock up and wait until we hear back from them. That was 30 minutes ago. Also, Dave, if you're coming up anytime soon, could you be a deer and bring me a nuka? Seems George had the last one up here. You know, you'd think after several games of it, hello, it would get a little old reading these stories of the last hours before. Why, thank you, Codsworth. That's very sweet of you. Um, the last hours... Uh, before the bombs fell, and after the bombs fell. But it doesn't. It's interesting to see all the little stories people have. <laughs> Just here to watch you inadvertently walk over a tripwire trip and go boom. Oh, thank you, Isa. Really good on public radio. I'll take the antiseptic and the cigar box for selling. Okay. Uh, let's clear out the upper floor first. So the walkways. Da, 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 da. Nothing will be more emblematic of this playthrough than me wandering through an already dead um, factory, looting things, humming to myself, and reading off of terminals, and occasionally shooting... So oh, I think we found what killed the raiders. Oh, it's down below us? Okay. Huh. Yes, I wander around with my Pip-Boy light on all the time. I want them to find me. I haven't used a Medex in, like, a hundred hours of gameplay. Alright, nothing I want to scrap. There's probably... I should, probably should be grabbing... Oh, great. Well, congrats, Sean. You saw it happen, and I didn't actually go boom. I'll sell the scalpel. Right, 200-year-old vegetable soup. Sure. You know what bothers me? Vodka doesn't pass the vodka line in this game. I should explain that for the 50th time. So, growing up, as a teenager, my friends and I would play a lot of Fallout 3. Well, we played a lot of Oblivion and a lot of Fallout 3, and we had a good time with it, and oh, that's a down below. Okay, well, I figured out where I'm going to be going next. Um, and we played it enough that we really got to know the game. Um, and one of the things that we discovered was that very little of the loot in Fallout 3 was worth looting. It was best to just leave it all behind. However, there was a hard line um, that you could draw between what was and was not worth looting. And it was based on the uh, weight ratio. Oh, God damn it! Right, whatever. Ow, hey, I was going to loot that. That's actually pretty cool that that explodes. I like that. Um, Are you attempting an ambush? Oh, it's synths. That's that's fantastic. I'm carrying too much and can't run. Codsworth, get over here. Oh, shit. Heads up. <sighs> All right, you can't throw grenades, so you get to carry them. The vodka line is an incredible term. I want to see it used in every game ever. 
Um, yeah, the, the, it, I, I'm still proud of it. But um, the vodka line, the price of vodka, is the core price of vodka, before modifications due to your barter skill and personality and all that jazz, um, is 20 caps for each vodka, which weighs one pound in game. 20 to 1 is the vodka line. If it's a better... Um, if it's a better ratio, if it's equal to or better ratio of caps to weight, then vodka, um, in that game specifically, the vodka line varies from game to game. Um, if it's better than that, then it's worth picking up. If it's not, you leave it behind. That was a really long-winded explanation for a really simple, um, simple concept, but the vodka line... Uh, as a principle, you figure out what a game's vodka line is, and you can figure out what's worth picking up and what's not at a glance. Granted, this game is a lot more complex because, um, for example, uh, the makeshift batteries are really the only reliable source of lead in the game. And they're way heavier than their actual caps value. So there are other concerns as well. But why are there synths here? That's gruesome. But the vodka line, I'm not actually sure what this game's vodka line is. It's somewhere between 15 and 25. All right, so that's the end of the line. Your one endurance character would have died just being in the same building as that explosion. Yeah, Sean here decided to do a, uh, a character with one endurance. And I think eventually, too, because you did get the bobblehead. Yeah, it's, it's a bit weird that the uh, old food is still here. That's kind of dumb. Um, the preserved stuff which is implied to be really disgusting and bad for you. Um, some of that would still be here, especially in the caches you can find, but... All right, assholes, come here. Come here. Fuck nuggets. Wow, I am a terrible shot. Go fuck yourself. I'll take that, thank you. Leaded... Eat me. Uh, fusion cells for the wife. Probably got some. Yep, there's some dudes. Uh, do I want to pass them by? I'm gonna eat something while I think. Baked bloatfly. Oh, there's somebody up and above. I can just sit around and wait for everybody to come to the it. Right in the face. Love it. Where's your gun? Fuck it. Nice job shooting your buddy in the back there. Patso18, thank you for the follow. Oh, hey, you. Wow. Point blank, I am still a terrible shot. It is 210 years post bomb. Are you really using a pipe pistol? No, you were using the shock baton. That'll scrap for some cool shit. Cells, 38 rounds. Wow, one of you really was using a pipe pistol. Okay. Oh, you're doing a bunch of damage, okay. Three oh eight 
combat sniper. Okay, now we can go be methodical. Probably. Are they up here? Codsworth having some fun with them. More resource efficient to aim your weaponized projectiles at hostile enemy units. Take the cigar to sell. Uh, Macro facilities key. I already have that, but whatever. Take the stim pack of the right away, though. Why would you put the key right there? That's not a puzzle. That's just, oh hey, we wanted you to accidentally not get the experience for picking that lock. Okay, no, that's a, that's a way. Did these guys just have a banging party last night? That's it. Yeah, they uh, they've had an adventure. Codsworth, where the hell are you? I realize you're you're off enjoying the wonders of of synth company at the moment. Oh, hi. Man, these guys are doing a lot more damage. Some healing, thank you. Crispy deathclaw steak. Hmm. If any of this is actually worth picking up to scrap, I'll leave it for now. Wait, I can't jump down there. There we go. Thank you. Oh, I hear a legendary synth trooper. Yay! Ooh, Tesla science. There we go. Uh, I'm gonna mark that off on my checklist. Tesla. Macra fish packing. Save. Not that I actually use energy weapons, but you know, whatever. Those, uh, technical document. By the way, feel free to shout at me if I'm leaving behind cool stuff that I should be looting. Boop, boop, yes. boop, boop, boop. Nah. Mm, I'll take the oil. You know what the, the piece of Fallout 3 random junk that isn't in this game that weirds me out? Draconic Chaos. Thank you for the follow. Ow, rude. Excuse you. I'll get to you in a second. Okay, that's all of that. What is in this terminal? Oh, I can't because I'm getting shot. A uh her. -huh. Yeah, the fans in the hot place, I've been looting for um, uh, the entirety of my playthrough, so I have lots of the stuff. Sentinel's baseball bat. I need to heal. Thank you. So I'm going to take a few more shots. Well, I do that. And boom. Man, well, all the synths in this place are high level. Jeez. I love how I knocked away everything but his head. Ooh, let it. Awesome. But, uh, yeah, fans and hot plates have been on my list for a while. You are correct in that I should have been looting them. Ooh, a nuke mine. That's going in the collection, not actually getting used. <laughs> Told you you could stop. 
Fair enough. Fair enough. Alright. Uh, not everything is dead, but I am going to go loot about for a minute. I think I've already been back here, yes. You should get intimidation points for ignoring your enemies in a game. He's just standing there, why is he just standing there? I'll take this impact, thank you. I have a truly ludicrous amount of healing on me. Coupled with the natural healing that I go through whenever I stand in sunlight, um... Ridiculous. That's it. Ooh, folders. Which are indeed were oh right, there was a terminal that I was supposed to go look through. Alright. Wiser. Okay. There we go. Oh, it's just protector on control. That sure is some aluminum. I almost ran out of that while I was crafting weapon stuff. In fact, I did run out of that. I'm just gonna... I'm gonna take all of these. Yeah, I was also picking up typewriters for a while. You know what? I'm so over-encumbered, I might as well. Right, let's go back to that other terminal that I left behind. See what that's about. Thermostat. Larry. Seems someone accidentally bumped into the thermostat today, raising the temperature a full three degrees. Our maintenance guy discovered the problem during a routine temperature check around 6 p.m. This is the third time this sort of thing has happened. Last time we ended up almost losing our entire inventory for the day. Oh, it was for the food. That makes sense. Last time we ended up almost losing our entire inventory for the day. Our guys have, have here say that we were lucky this time, the day's supply wasn't spoiled. Let me know if you want the scientists to come down and do an analysis of a few batches just to make sure. Nuka. Jane. Sorry, won't be able to make it up with your Nuka. They shut off the main lift, so it seems we'll be stuck down here for a while. If you hear anything else about what's going on outside, let me know. I felt some rumbling and shaking a little while ago. A couple of the shipments fell off the shelves, but nothing we can't take care of. Anyway, take care, and again, let me know if you hear anything. A lot of concerned people down here. Alright, now I'm certain there's a place I haven't been. Right there is a place I haven't been. A middle floor. Let's see if I can get there. Oh, hey, more aluminum. Good God, that is a lot of trays. I mean, I'm so over-encumbered, I might as well grab it all. Technically, I might as well grab anything, but I really don't feel like it. Sweet. Huh, it just stops there, okay. Okay, I have already been here. Got my murder on. Okay, so there's a place I haven't been yet. Statistically speaking, your survival is... Okay, cut that out. Cosworth is great. Here, 
then here. Ah, here we go. Then here. Ah, here is the way forward that I have, in fact, been on. Okay. Have I found everything in here? I think I found everything in here. Take the oil from the blowtorch. Yeah, I've been everywhere. I guess the synths are up on the lift? Maybe? Well... Let's then. Codesworth, where the hell are you? Is there a typewriter in here I wanted to grab? <coughs> Excuse me. Alright, where's the elevator? Appears to be nothing movement detected. Yep, they're all the way up there. Let's get something that's a bit more effective here. Attacking human. Okay, that is less effective, noted. Since in this area are high level. All right, Codsworth. Move here. Get up, buddy. Sharp synth right arm. Charisma and intelligence. Might as well take it. I don't need the extra stats. I need things like. Reduced AP consumption and all that jazz. Uh, path. All right, ask clown. I'm over here. Why is your CPU in your head? It should really be in your torso or something. <coughs> There's some wonder glue. Oh, my throat. Have I not been up here? I sworn I was up here. Nice. Imports. Cod averaged 100 to blah, blah, blah. Supply steady, supply steady. Supply increased for Cod, decreased Haddock, increased Boston Blue, supply rate steady for Flounder. Boston Blue. Alright, that's just exports. None of this is interesting information. Nobody cares about fish. Even the people who work in the fishing industry don't care about the fishing industry stats. Nobody cares. Why would you show me that? Yeah, I know I know they they rise with you. It's just that um usually less so. All right. Uh yeah, I'm over encumbered. Codsworth. Heads up. See how much you can carry. Nope. He is full. Alright, well, I guess we're heading back to uh, Sanctuary to... Junk some crap. Man, it's good to be streaming console games again. It's been years. I've missed, I've missed being able to do this. Oh my god, there are synths out here too. Hey, don't you shoot my friend.
You know what? Later, Sean. Thanks for coming by, man. And thanks for the help. Alright, asshole, why are you lighting me on fire? Who told you you could light me on fire? I can't... I can't aim my body. I cannot aim my body. What is wrong with me? I deserve all the damage I'm taking. Oh, they're shooting me from up there as well. All right. Gotcha. Yeah, I'm going to have to get um a different setup set for um older console games that don't have an HDMI cable, I think. Some of it. Fuck's sake. Just put one in his guts. And... Do a little looting. There he is, okay. Uh, are, are you sure you don't just have a... Um, are you sure you just don't have an old Elgato? Because Elgato is the one I keep hearing as the recommendation. Alright, we're gonna... Go this way. Junk some stuff, then go back um, and actually do the mission we went out there to do. So here's a question for everybody who's still in the audience. Um, and I do mean everybody who's listening. I'd like to get your opinions on this. I've played through about half of the game. Would it be better for me to stream more on this file? Or for me to start a new file, I have all the DLC, start a new file, um, and play through on that. Oh yeah, you don't you don't have a game capture card. Um, and play through on that, so you guys get to experience the whole story with my snark. Alright, uh, bloop and bloop. And I'm actually going to get my shit from you. Look alive. Here's what I have. Doop, 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 doop. Um, but yeah, which would be more interesting? Do you want to see the whole game from my perspective? Oop, I... What happens if I scrap a frag grenade? Where is it? Oh, hey, a mop I missed. Cannot scrap a frag grenade. Got it. Wow. Okay, that was a lot. You don't know anything about the story except that Final Pam destroys the world? Well, you're not that far off. Alright, 
drop all the lead. Keeping the shadow to I bought helmet. Okay, and you, and you, 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 you. Uh, da, da, da. Coolant. One, two, three, four. New blue. Gas can. More at hide. You'd like to see the full game, okay? That is a lot. That is a lot of trays. Time, typewriter, wonder glue. Whoops. Get out of the way, Sturgis. Oh my god. Oh my god, the entire town. Really? The entire town? Oh my god. Get out of my way. So we've got one vote for full game, one vote for I know nothing about this game, which is a vote for full game. Oh, some chalk I didn't scrap ages ago. I hate the asphalt here. All the detection issues it has. Okay. Asbestos. Chalk scraps into asbestos. Get out of my way. What am I going in here for? Buddy, where'd you go? Drinking buddy. The most annoying creature in the universe. Because at least the adoring fan speaks quickly. I'm actually going to leave you a beer. Lager, Nuka Cherry, Nuka Cola, Quantum. Alright, good enough. Let's be on our way, shall we? Wait, is the Aldersea Day Spa a location in Far Harbor? Did did he give me a did Knight Reese give me a place in Maine to go clear out? Is that what happened? I'm gonna go north. Well, I'll discover me the place where Far Harbor begins, I guess. <clears throat> I'm pointed that way. 
Oh, help defend Green Top Nursery. That's what that is. Got it. Let's see what's in the sunken boat. Yeah, some of the perks I don't like because they... They take away parts of the game that I do like. Hello. Random glowing one? Did you just jump into the water? You moron. The subway token. Oh my god. I am a terrible shot. He gave me... God damn. I'm presuming that this, um... This marker is taking me to the uh, entryway for Far Harbor, then? Wait, there was a thing he was on. Let's see what he was guarding. Can I not? Oh, it's just a... <laughs> he used radioactive barrels for a raft. What kind of idiot. But yeah, um, like Aqua Boy, I don't like the Aqua Boy perk because it takes away one of the most clever things about this game. One of the things I think is a straight up upgrade from Fallout 3 and New Vegas is the way the rad system works. In the old games, you got rad sickness at 200, 400, 600, 800 rads and then died at 1000. It was an okay system. Um, in this game, the more rads you have, the lower your max health is. And that means rad management is vital and it's really cool and you know the game is not the hardest to cheese but i i like that aspect of it but taking aqua boy takes away the rads you get from swimming and all that jazz excuse me all right what's over here take the oil take the life preserver for my collection Leave the fine wine, take the bug meat. Yep, he gave me a place in Far Harbor. Alright, I'm gonna discover this place. Damn it. Damn it! Come in! I know you're listening on the other end. Where is she? Where is my daughter? Kenji, please. You've been at this for hours. Stop. You need sleep. She's out there, Ray. Someone has her. Yeah, I will want Nick. Or gunners, or God knows what else. Right. Okay, well, we're skipping Knight Reese's quest then. Um, what do we got? Let's go give Kent the Silver Shroud costume. Let's help defend Green Top Nursery, actually. Then give Kent the Silver Shroud costume. Oh my god, that's disgusting. I didn't realize you could zoom in that far on the bastard. All right, which direction is the fight? That away, apparently.
Wow, okay. That went down fast. Hey, uh, oh, that's a missile launcher. That's why it went down fast. Gotcha. Asshole. There you are, thank you. Oh, there's more. Oh, everything's on fire. Why is everything on fire? Codsworth, what are you doing? Why do they all have missile launchers? What I think of the Silver Shroud quest? I, um, I've literally just seen, uh, the guy asked me to go get the Silver Shroud stuff. I happened to cross the Silver Shroud stuff accidentally, and then I'm about to go give him the Silver Shroud costume. I have seen the Silver Shroud dialogue with the Mechanist. I think the voice sounds really stupid. Apparently. All right, let's fix things up, shall we? Um, do I not need to fix it? Okay, it's all fixed, apparently. Got anything cool here? We do not. Well, that's taken care of. Let's heal a little. Codsworth. The hell did you go? Screw it. To good neighbor. The T-60 series of power armor saw extensive use by the... whatever. Good neighbor indeed. No one here is trying to win any awards for cleanliness. The salt is real. Right, are you holding anything? Look alive. You are not. Not anything I want to sell. Don't worry. I only test the weapons on customers I don't like. Feel free to browse. Sure. Sure. Let's take a look. Let's get you outfitted, killer. Cleo weirds me out. I'm not ashamed of saying it. Bull barrel? Sort of like how so many people are bandits in Skyrim. Exactly like that, yeah. Some fusion cells for the wife. Some lead to scrap. <laughs> I'm in a lead. Shoddy shells. Okay. Keep the nuke mine for my collection. Cigar box. Cigarettes. Flip lighter. Fuse. The cigarette. Pack of cigarettes. Pocket watches, and bam. You need, an, you need an economy larger than the raider population or else they'd consume literally everything. 
I've always thought that the uh, the settlers in any of these places are meant to be symbolic rather than literal numbers. Like, there's a lot more people in Good Neighbor than you see, for example. I heard you walk that freedom trail. What, you're some kind of, what do they call it? It's three bucks. Who told you that? That was supposed to be a secret. I'm watching you. Sometimes you wish you could use, like, speechcraft to reason with them sometimes, or not all of them be bad guys, because basically just shoot everything I see, because they're almost always 99% of the time hostile. Make combat more interesting if you had to decide between friendly and hostile NPCs. Yeah, it's, it's functionally impossible to play this game without killing enemies. There are ways to do it, but... Hi, friend. I got your costume, Kent. And some other goodies you might like. There she is. Pretty as the posters. A silver shroud costume herself. And memorabilia, too? You're something else. Together with my gun, everything's all set. What are you planning next? I'm still working that out. Some details I want to run by you. Well, after you give me the costume, that is. Here you go. After all these years, the Silver Shroud is born again. But there's just one problem. I'm just not Silver Shroud material. I could be Rhett Reinhardt or, or his butler, Jarvie Blake. But the Shroud is strong, capable. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Do I have to decide whether I get to do it or he gets to do it? Oh, my God. Ugh. What happens to the suit? Oh, I have an idea who should wear it. You up for being the Okay, he's just going to tell me. You already got your own origin story and everything. What with the cryo vault and all. How do you know that? Why me? You helped me out when everyone else just laughed at me. And you're from the olden days, just like me. You know how much things have fallen? How much we got to fight for to make the place be better? So you win? I get to be the shroud. The costume and gun are yours. So you patrol good neighbor's streets, and I'll call in any crimes on my radio station. Here oh my god. Some calling cards, I guess. When you dispatch justice, leave them behind. That way, everyone knows the silver shroud has returned. Time to fight crime! Right. I'm gonna leave that for another day. Alright, I think we'll do one more thing before I call it a stream and get to editing out the middle third of the video. Uh, let's see. Hmm. You know what? Let's go find the signed... Uh, Signed cards and stuff. Spell card, catcher's mitt. I'm Batman. I'm Batman. Oh, I can't fast travel from inside. Duh. Gotta go outside, stupid. Excuse me. Okay. Let's see about these baseball items. I have never seen a gunner in that helmet. Like, just straight up.
All right. All right. Oh, we are close. Okay. I'm overburdened. Why am I overburdened? Oh, damn, that's actually some pretty hefty armor for the Silver Shroud armor. Okay. Did you mod that, Earl? Hey, Codsworth. Take some of this off me, will you? Uh, boop, boop, and boop. And boop, and boop, boop. Boop, and boop. There. Now I can move easy. Okay, what do we have here? I guess I will go around and find out. There we go. Don't see anything to lock on to. Westing Estate. Oh, this is the place with the... And that's one half of the cat, thank you. I love how he actually addresses me by name randomly, that's awesome. Signed catcher's mitt in a toolbox. What? There's going to be a Mire Alert Queen when I'm done finding this stuff, isn't there? Oh, the shroud armor looks really cool. I have seen it. It's just the voice. The voice is so dumb. I'm sorry if I'm a buzzkill party pooper, but I don't enjoy it. Somebody here really liked them some borse bowl. Got it. That is actually really cool how detailed that is. Stop by a little thing like a lock, will we, sir? Okay, let's check over here, then go into the heart of the place and fight whatever boss is waiting in the weeds for me. There is Nothing of note there. All right. Water holds no peril for me. go. Come and get me, asswipe. Are you really not going to come upstairs? Where are you going? Screw it. Come and get me. Ow. Rude. Oh, shit. Huh. Chameleon leather t chest piece. Well, I don't sneak much, so... This is a good time to fill up the water. 
what am I doing in lieu of saving my son today? Uh, finding ancient baseball paraphernalia. A lot of SU fans are pleased to note that you can name yourself Perry Dot and Cogs will call you Perry. That's wonderful. Oh, there's a tree growing in here. Apparently water to drink from. In a cooler. All right. Matt the Missile Murtaugh. I'm sure you can zoom in and figure out what all that says. But I don't have the patience for the eye strain. All right, well, let's take it back to Mo. Those would be cool trophies to hang on to, but, you know. Quests. I think I'll turn that into Mo and then call it a stream. Because my throat is sore as hell. Um, I really should be getting to bed soonish. But. It's good to know that I can get this shit working. Hey, can somebody hit the uptime command? See uh, see if that function works. I haven't tested it uh, in a while. So, this is the famous Diamond City. I suppose I hope to find more of a gem than a dusty home base. Civilization in the rough, if you will. <laughs> He's fun. I like him. All right, Mo. Hey, it's you. You find any of those baseball items I mentioned? God, you're hideous. Got them all right here. I like your gumption. Let me take a look. This baseball, it's the real deal. You'd sign one of these and give it to the children of anyone you killed on the field. Look at that card. See those numbers on the back? Tracks the count of enemies beaten to death by the player. Check out the leather on that mitt. Ah, really good players use them to catch bullets. True fact there. That's everything on the list. <laughs> Thank you. Far as I'm concerned, you're now a part of baseball collector history. I forgot how... Well, I forgot his insane ideas about baseball. Let's see what Codsworth has to say about him. Hey, Mo. You're the greatest baseball collector I've met in a long time. Hey, Thanks again for bringing me those relics. Now, you buying a swatter today? What's a swatter? <laughs> Rookie, eh? A swatter, my friend, is a Diamond City tradition. See, it used to be that this whole place was a stadium. And two teams would meet and play a game called baseball. One team would beat the other team to death with these things called baseball bats. And, and the best bats were called swatters. True fact. Look, dumbass, that's not how baseball was played. That right, Mr. Smarty Pants? Hey, if you're such an expert, how do you think it was played? There were balls, strikes, three bases, and home runs. He kept score by how many runners made it to home plate. Yes, none of this beating people to death nonsense. I like my version better. Now. Can I interest you? Oh in my god. Authentic custom made hickory swatters. Kiri is adorable, by the way. She goes on about about how interesting the statistics of baseball are. Oh my god, she is the most precious companion in any Bethesda game I have ever encountered. Whoop. Whoops. What am I? Strike yes, you are. I don't need anything. Stop crowding my stall, then. Can you believe this asshole, Cosworth? Got anything to say about the broken robot, Cods? I have somewhere to be. Sorry. I'm on to you. <laughs> you like his version of baseball? Need some custom hardware? We got a free workbench for all all right, well, I think I'm going to cut the stream, having done that quest. It was a fun little... Oh, man, you got a robot butler? 
I want to live Sorry, life. buddy. Um... I think I'm going to cut the stream there with that quest. It was a fun to wander around with you guys and just explore the land. Um, what did you guys think of the stream? Yeah, Codsworth, I gave him a bowler hat. Uh, what did you guys think of this as a stream? Me just wandering around and doing quests and killing raiders and looting and looting and looting and looting and looting and looting. looting. What did you think? Did you like it? Do you want to see more of it? Do you want me to start a fresh file um, just for you guys? What do you guys think I should do? More Fallout 4 on this file? Uh, a brand new file? Play through the story and stuff? My wife is a synth. Every piece in here is worth what I charge for it. No argument. She's allowed here. I've got a few minutes to browse. Here's what we got. All right. Uh, I'll take the 10 mil rounds and the 556 ammo. Let's see. Anything else I want to grab? Take the Brahmin meat. I suppose I'll take the drugs too, so I can craft better drugs and sell them back. Wi-Fi network connection lost. What? That's weird. Oh, dirty water for recipes. The audio issues aside, you did like this. You want more of this file if I'm continuing. Hmm, that's a bunch of antiseptic. I didn't mean to take the kickball. Let's see, I'll take the mentats. Rat meat. Go figure. Purified water is a pain in the ass, but dirty water is is always exciting to find. You think I should start a new game, be the female for better voice acting? Maybe. I might play as myself again. Just to, you know, have a, a, a stream file where all of you can experience the game with me. Plus, you can get more Curie in a fresh file. Um, oh, yeah, no, I'm... Actually, I might do New Vegas for... No, I want to... I want to get through the story of this game and really experience it all. So I'll probably do Fallout 4 first. But then I am going to do New Vegas. Because I have a 360, and I have New Vegas with all the DLC. And that has a... Um, that has an HDMI cable port, so I can use my Roxio and not have to figure out anything with a different capture card that I don't own yet. The hell happened to you, lady? Wow, she's having a bad day. But yeah, you guys will be able to see how adorable Curie is. I think I will start a fresh file for you guys. Gonna figure out how I can get... Um... There is also Fallout 1 as a streaming possibility. I think Fallout 4 is gonna be the first Fallout that I stream. But then I'm gonna do the other stuff. Thank you again for Fallout 1, Minda. That's gonna be a really interesting experience. I, I I could talk to her. Yes. You okay? Don't talk to me. Wow. I think that's even sadder than what I was saying about her. Hey there. Hey there. Whatever you want, I ain't got time. Hi. This whole market smells. Like noodles and blood and shampoo and ammo. That is four very distinct smells. 
I wonder what the mix of that would actually smell like. That's horrifying to think about. Anyway, I'm going to call the stream here. I'm going to get to editing the video so that I can actually upload it uh, without all the technical difficulties in the middle. Um, if it weren't obviously ripping off Achievement Hunter, I would get a technical difficulties thing. Um, but uh, thank you all so much for tuning in. This has been a lot of fun. I will see you guys another time.